just got all the essentials. Green smoothie, iced coffee. Let's get it. what Gretchen and I do to get a good Instagram picture. <laughs> there used to be a wet floor sign right in the middle of the ground and we literally just moved it all the way down there. Be, how many wet floor signs do we have to move for a good picture? <laughs> and now we're in Toronto. We didn't even need this, this was fake news. I know, that was fake news. But look at us, waiting with all these other people because our flight to Venice is delayed by a really long time, so. Yeah. I don't know what to do other than like sit here. But at least we made it. And also, our landing was really bad. Ew, I can't even look at myself for <laughs> taking so many snapshots of me, but our landing was really bad. It literally, the plane was going like this and then just went <laughs> on the ground and I was like, oh my God, I never want to fly. We're ordering food. This is so cool. You like sit on these tables that have iPads and order the food and they bring it to you from over there. So that is exactly what I did. And I'm trying to check out right now, but my order keeps failing, but this is what I got. Overland. Some wine and Greek salad with chicken. <laughs> is this not the funniest thing ever? I come back and all of these are next to Gretchen and I. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys, I did a little Extra. haul because we obviously just ordered dinner, which you guys will see in a second. And then look what I got. Um, a big bag of snacks and this is how you stay healthy while traveling. I got one for you snacks. and one for me. You're so and they're cool. Buddha Bowl Himalayan Pink Salt Organic Popcorn. And these are perfect because they're just light, something easy to snack on the plane. I also got a banana just in case I'm hungry, just because those are healthy. Really, really good for you. <laughs> and then I also I got and then I also got a thing of mixed nuts. And this one is only 115 calories, which I like don't count calories and calories don't really like matter to me, but nuts are very, very high in calories. So sometimes like when you eat a bag of nuts, like it can be up to like 500 calories, which is just like more than a serving that like, your body can handle. So this one's perfect just cause it's like one serving and it's a bunch of different nuts and like dried cranberries and walnuts, almonds, that stuff. You guys could totally make this at home. What else did I get? I got a water, a big smart water. You guys know I love smart water. And then I also got this Kind Bar. And what I like about these ones, this is the almond sea salt and dark chocolate one. This Kind Bar only has, where is it? I don't know if my camera will focus, but it only has five grams of sugar, which is good because some of the Kind Bars have like 20 grams of sugar and they're really bad for you. Like all that added sugar just is so unnecessary. So that is my little haul for the day. Ugh. This is why I was scared to get the Greek salad, because what is this? <laughs> That's legit <laughs> not chicken. I know it does. <laughs> but I'm excited for the wines. I just took a cute little boomerang from my Instagram story. Wait, there's chicken in my thing too. I wonder if it's okay. It probably is. This one's just really weird. I just forgot. But whatever. What At least we're eating greens. You feel me? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I've never been so happy to be off it. that plane. It's so bright out here. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Wow. So what I was saying before is we just landed. And when I was on the plane sleeping, I actually lost one of my AirPods. Like I had my ear and I woke up and I was like, oh my god, it's so weird. 
Like I don't know where it is and I don't watch and I was literally like put our flashlights on in the pitch black. Um, and we're like trying to find it and we couldn't find it anywhere. I was so sad and like we waited and like we were the last ones off the plane because we wanted to look for my AirPods. And then finally the girls who like worked on the plane were like, oh, are you, do you guys see anything? Like what do you, like do you need help or whatever? Because we were like still on it. And we were like, yeah, like I lost my AirPod. And one girl was just like looking around and she's like, yeah, it's the white thing, right? And I'm like, yeah. And she was like, oh my God, here it is. So anyway, I found my AirPod and I'm really happy, but it's so hot here. Like I'm still wearing my sweatshirt and sweatpants and all the clothes I've been wearing since yesterday. And it's so annoying. And I want to change so bad. We finally made it to Venice and we showered and everything. <laughs> so now we feel so much better. Look how pretty it is. We're finally getting time to like walk around by ourselves right now and everything is so cool. Isn't it so pretty? So cool. It's like how I expected it to look. Like yeah. by pictures and stuff, like everything looks right. so, I don't know how to describe it. And we're in Venice right now. I've been like saying that obviously. And then we have two other cities that we are going to that you guys will also see in the vlogs. But it's just so nice out. And right now it's like almost five o'clock. And so we are, meeting back up with our group at six to go back for like this party that you guys will see. But we have a little bit of time to like walk around alone, which I really like. Gretchen and I just took a bunch of photos along this little canal area, which I know tomorrow we'll be doing more stuff and we're gonna be in the city for longer. But today we just got free time, which was really nice. So we kind of just got to like walk off on our own and like chill and see everything. But one of my favorite parts about it is that everything is like white and pink and like peach colored and I don't know, I just think it's so it's like pretty. Pastel. It's like pastel and like this building's orange and the next one's like peach and like blush colored. I don't know, I really like it. And it's right on the water. So there's a bunch of like fresh seafood and stuff. I can like smell the salt water. and I just got back from our long day and look we got a brand new yeah. room and it feels so good because last time we were sharing with there were literally like it was smaller than this and there were six bunk beds in it and it was Gretchen and I and a bunch of other oh, girls three bunk beds. There were six beds. oh well six beds three bunk beds and so it was us with like a bunch of different other girls and which was totally fine like if we didn't have to film and like do YouTube and stuff, we just felt like we were gonna be like disturbing we them and stuff. Them. No, we literally were. These girls were probably like, oh my god. And so then <laughs> we talked to like the leader, our um, I almost call them our orientation leader. <laughs> what is our tour guide, Tyson? He's super nice. And we were like, Tyson, we thought we signed up for like the two bedroom. Like we hate to like ask about this, like whatever. And he was like, no, no, no. Like you guys um have two bedroom or like two people to a bedroom, which is obviously Gretchen and I in Rome and, and Florence. And then also now finally in Venice we do because the driver actually lives locally. So they were like, oh, the driver like doesn't need a room anymore. So we were like, thank God. So now we have our big room and then it also has a bathroom, which has like the toilet and that weird little thing right there and the shower. And then, wait, is this a ring light? Oh, it's <gasps> We have a mirror. Oh my God. Like Wait, a ring light. Have a mirror. I don't want to do my makeup. God, you've answered my prayers. Wow, this is actually like good lighting. It's perfect lighting. It's like a giant ring light. Wow. So now we have this big room and a big bed, so now we can snuggle together. And I'm gonna unpack all my stuff like I just did before, just underneath here. I like taking it out of my suitcase and just like plopping it in. Um, but now I'm gonna unpack all of my stuff, just put my packing cubes in this little 
bin right there. Let me see if Gretchen has one over there. Yeah, and Gretchen has one on the other side, which is really good. And then I'll probably like store my suitcase somewhere over in the corner. So I just took a body shower. We're finally done like with our whole entire day. And it's 9.04 p.m. We landed around 11 o'clock today. So it's been like a really busy day. We've just been like trying to see some of the city, like eating, meeting everybody, stuff like that. Like the vlogs that are coming will be more like interesting and stuff. But this one was just like traveling and an introduction to Venice and the trip. But make sure you're subscribed if you are new and if you're not already because I'm going to be posting so many videos this trip. And also I asked you guys on my Instagram if you wanted me to do um, like a specific or like one video for every single city we go to. Like I'll do like a Venice vlog, a Rome vlog, and a Florence vlog. And I didn't know like if you guys liked that idea or like what the deal was so leave a comment down below and like let me know your thoughts or if i should just do a daily vlog so yeah we have to get up super early in the morning and honestly right now it's like three o'clock at home if it's nine here yeah it's like 3 p.m and i'm exhausted so i feel like i'm already kind of this is the perfect bedtime i know i'm like already ready to go to bed and stuff and then we're gonna wake up early in the morning and then we have like a ton of stuff to do tomorrow that you guys will see but thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in my next one